director call. Hi, Sarah, could you please transfer me to the NICU? Hi there, uh, this is Snerman here. Uh, we were wondering, do you guys accept uh, baby clothes uh, donations? Yes, we do. Awesome. Uh, we have uh, twins at home and we have a lot of their clothes that uh, we would like to donate. How do we... How do we... Awesome. Hey guys, so we just arrived at the hospital and at the door there's a sign saying that we are not allowed to record. So I'm gonna still try to record while I'm in there and see how it goes. So hopefully they, they won't uh, stop me but if they do what can i do uh, but uh, let's go and see here we go let's go let's see how it goes I'm inside right now. I gotta go to the second floor, I believe. Uh, let's see. Okay. I can't remember, I think it's the second or third floor for their NICU department here. So. This is it. It's been like six, seven months since I've been here. Uh, Nikyu here. Nikyu just around the corner. Yeah. There. Hi. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. I spoke with somebody. I don't know if it was you this yes, morning. You did, I. Yeah. Uh, we have a bunch of like clothes. Awesome. And okay. we wanted to donate. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, who was the last name? Uh, last name is... Here you okay. go. Thank you. Thank you so much. You guys have a great weekend. Oh my gosh, you too. Thank you. You're very welcome. Bye. Okay, guys. So... Uh, I just dropped off the clothes. Baby clothes to the NICU department. The guys here are really amazing. And they, they did a fantastic job. And... Uh, and uh, uh, we just wanted to pay it back and show a little bit of of appreciation for what they do here. And uh, um, yeah, it's just a small thank you from from our family. We like to give back whenever we can. And uh, yeah, so. Sanya and the twins are waiting outside of the hospital, so I'm heading back. We're gonna go back, and then uh, today, we really don't have any plans. We're just going to go and uh, and uh, maybe drive around a little bit, grab some food or something. We'll see how it goes from here. And uh, yeah, let's go. Hey guys, sorry I have to be a little bit quiet uh, today, the twins are in the other room sleeping. Today is October 25th and uh, here in US it's 8, 
holiday, say Thanksgiving Day. So I want to wish everybody happy Thanksgiving. I hope you guys eat a lot of turkey and uh, stay warm wherever you are. Um, so this week's uh, vlog, uh, I have family coming over and we are going to be barbecuing the turkey. I've already been... I got the grill going outside. Let me show you. There it is, fire is getting ready. Um, the temperatures, it's 48 Fahrenheit here today, so it's not too cold. I mean, it should be. Here in Illinois, we are not the only one that to do the turkey today. It's Thanksgiving. So. It's Thanksgiving, everybody's doing turkey. Um, so the weather is same for everyone here in Illinois. Yeah, but I think most people are, are probably making it in the house. We, we choose to barbecue. Well, we do like the, barbe the rotisserie, yeah. and we like the grilling, and we like the Weber. In all honesty, not, I, I am of the opinion nothing beats the grill. Any type of uh, food yeah. or grill yes. or, or a meat you grill compared to the oven, no chance. The grill wins every single time. Like I love, we, we love grilled uh, food. So the turkey is no exceptions. Today we are barbecuing it on a rotisserie. And uh, yeah, we're really excited to try it. Uh, so let's go, let's get it. I'm feeling great. Turkey is done and uh, I'm waiting to get a piece of this. Guys, the turkey is done and uh, we're about to prep it up. Family is already in the house waiting. I'm just gonna let the turkey sit for about 15-20 minutes and then we're gonna cut it up and uh, have a nice turkey uh, dinner. I'm pretty happy how this came about. Today I wanna talk a little bit about stress levels of from being a parent and raising twins at home one of the things I mean for any parent it's very difficult uh, especially the, those first 12 months uh, but for us with twins I, I don't know I don't know if there is any way you can really explain this into words the amount of work it takes I think uh, unless you're a parent of twins you understand but one of the things that I like doing that's helped me is going out almost every day uh, and uh, this helps me clear my head and uh, helps me stay focused and uh, figure out what I need to do uh, for the rest of the day uh, right now I'm with the babies and uh, this gives a chance also to Sanya to work around the house and uh, make a lunch breakfast what have you but for me just getting out of the house going and going for a walk uh, for like half an hour or so maybe sometimes listening to an audio book me clear my head I feel 10 times better when I come back home feel more focused and uh, I also it helps me relieve the stresses uh, I like to say if you're a parent and you're uh, you surely know everything that involves in raising an infant I encourage you if you're not doing it already is to always find some time to go out whether it is with your significant other or by yourself go out even if it's for 10-15 minutes just get out there and uh, I promise you you will feel 10 times better and uh, I do this every day, try to do it every day. Sometimes I don't get an opportunity, but for the most part, I'm out every single day. I go for a walk, sometimes even twice. Sometimes I'll take a walk in the morning 
and I'll take a walk in the evening if I can get away with it and that helps me greatly also another benefit is the our babies uh, we've already diffused so we, we've take take them for a walk with us and it helps them sleep better so if your babies are having a hard time falling asleep try taking them out for a walk get them uh, to be outside get them some fresh air and uh, for our twins uh, we notice they sleep much better when they come out outside with us so that's another benefit of being out and today it's a lovely day it's sunny it's cold but it's sunny uh, so I'm getting some vitamin D and it feels great go out spend some time with the babies outside it's gonna help you it's gonna help the babies uh, it's a win-win and uh, you will feel much much better